Welcome back to week two of our reading groups. Last week, we read all about fun forts, and this week we're going to continue to read, and this week we're going to read about Anne's book club. But before we do that, let's practice a couple different skills, and we practice these on Friday. So what we're going to do is we're going to drop the beginning sound. So if I said jet and then drop the J, what would I have left? Jet, et, met, et, rope, ope, soap, ope, pin, in, thin, in. Pause the video and you try. Say each word and then say what it would be if you dropped the beginning sound. Great job. Welcome back. So the next thing we're going to look at is we're going to look at something we call a VCCV word. Vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel word. We know that our vowels are A, E, I, O, U, and sometimes Y. And sometimes we have words that are more than one syllable. Words like insect, thunder, dexter, upset, problem, forget. And if we get stuck on one of these words, we break it apart in between the two consonants. So what we can see here is I is a vowel, vowel, N and S are consonant, consonant, E is a vowel. So we can break up this word right here, insect. Here we have our vowels, U and E, and we break it up right in the middle. Thunder, dexter, upset. Problem. For get. So today you're going to practice once again sorting one and two syllable words. So when you read the word, be very careful to see if it has one or two syllables and where you break it apart. Next, we're going to practice a couple words that you may see in your story today. These are what we call decodable words, words that you can sound out. So I'm going to sound them out and then I want you to pause the video and try to read them by yourself. Storms, storms, shaking, shaking, club, club, m, eat, meat, w, ings, wings, pick, ing, picking. Now it's your turn. Pause the video and you try. The last thing we're going to talk about today is our, our two sight words. Our first sight word is, do you know this word? You are correct. This is head. We all have a head. And this word is read, or we can say read. So if we say Miss Gates, or I can read a book. Or we can say last night I read my book. So we can say this word in two ways, read or read. So be very careful when you're reading your story today to see which way makes the most sense. So let's read. Today we're going to read Anne's Book Club. You're going to sort your words and then you're going to read Anne's Book Club. And as you read, I want you to think about two questions. I want you to think about what is the problem in the story? What's going on? What's wrong? What's happening? And how do they solve the problem? How do the kids solve the problem? So your story today is going to look like this, Anne's Book Club. And again, as you read, think about the problem and the solution. I can't wait to hear you read. Make sure you read with fluency. Remember, your periods are like stop signs. And good luck. <laughs>